I'm Tracy with Yoga with Tracy. Um, this is a nice little stretch that you can do at any time of the day. It's really just to get your body moving, the blood flowing, and you breathing a little bit more. So we're going to start on our mat with our feet hip width distance apart. I want you to bring your hands to your heart and we're going to stand in Tadasana to start with. That is mountain pose. Your thighs should be lifted, the belly is drawn in, Draw your chin slightly in, shoulders stacked right on top of the hips. We're going to take the deep breath in, take your arms all the way up, inhaling, and then exhale, take your hands to the heart. Okay, again, breathing in, and then exhale, take your hands to the heart. One more time, breathing in, and then exhale, take your hands to the heart. Now, hands up the midline, breathing in, Draw the belly in and sway slightly to the right side. Okay, come on back to center. Breathing in, shoulders are relaxed. Breathe out. <sighs> Inhale back to center and then lower that right hand down, sway to the side. Come on back up, both hands are touching, reaching. Inhale and then exhale. We're gonna lower that left hand, stretch over to the left side. Come on back up. Breathing in, reach. This time, right hand's gonna come down. Let's nudge that left shoulder and arm up, and then looking up gently, and then breathing out, looking down. We're gonna do that again. Breathing in and out. One more time. Inhale and exhale. Come on back up. Reach and lower, let's stretch to the other side. So be careful, every side of the body is different, and if it's too much, we don't do too much, right? So we're gonna nudge, look, inhale, and then exhale, look down. Again, breathing in, exhaling out, inhaling, and exhale. Come on back up, lift. This time, take your hands back down to the heart. <sighs> okay, arms all the way up. Breathing in and out. <sighs> Inhaling and exhaling. <sighs> Hands are gonna come down. Let's roll the shoulders out for three. Breathing two and one. Let's take the left arm all the way up. Imagine you're giving me an air five here and then release. Other side, breathing in, lengthening out right through the belly, all the way to those fingertips, and then release. Again, breathing in and out, inhaling and exhaling. Now let's take both hands up, lift in, and then as we come down with our hands, I want you to soften into your knees, okay, all the way up. Lifting, drawing the belly in, lengthening through the spine, breathing out. Again, breathing in. And soft shoulders, breathe out. Last one, breathing in, reaching, lengthening, and exhale. Now, let's take the arms all the way up. Interlace the fingers, draw the belly in, maybe point the fingers up to the sky. Draw the belly in and open up the chest a little bit more, looking up, slightly up to the sky, up to the ceiling, and imagine that you have a little grapefruit between, or a big grapefruit between the chin and the chest to so support the back of the neck. Don't forget to breathe, inhale, and then exhale. Let's release the hands down, relax the shoulders, shoulders stacking back on top of the hips. Well done, arms all the way up. Inhale, and then release. Exhale, take your hands down to the side. Okay, now, left arm's gonna come up, and then as we bring that hand down, I want you to lift that right leg up, okay? Other foot comes up, other hand comes up, and then as we lower this hand, the other foot's gonna come up, okay? So we're working on our balance and stability, breathing in, breathing out. So we need to have a nice tight belly, inhale, and exhale. Well done. We're going to do that one more time. Breathing in and out. Other side, breathing in and out. Now we're going to 
take the arm all the way up and then lifting that leg, placing the hand on the outside of that right thigh, taking the other hand all the way up and then opening up the chest for a gentle twist. Now, depending on how the body feels today, maybe you need to touch down that toe like this, or maybe you're holding in that nice stance. So belly's drawn in, micro band in that standing leg, we're opening up the chest, breathing in, and then exhale, we're twisting. So we're doing a twist and balance. Okay, one more breath here, in. And on the exhalation, we're releasing and unwinding. Okay, other side, lift the right arm up, exhale, hand down, comes across the outside of that right thigh. Other hand comes up, drawing the belly in, micro bend in that standing leg, Lifting and then exhaling, opening up for a gentle twist. Remembering that you can touch down with that leg. Shoulders are relaxed. Take a nice deep breath here. Inhaling and exhale. Again, breath here. In and then on the unwind, breathe out. Release. Well done. Take your arms all the way up. Inhale here, touch the fingers. Let's dive to the toes, breathe. Come right on down to the toes. Now, I'm gonna to turn around so you have a nice view here of my flat back. So tight belly, put the weight in the heels, bring your hands to the thighs, lengthening out the spine. You're gonna feel a nice little stretch in the back of the hamstrings. Breathe here, in, and then exhale, melt down to the floor. Okay, with a tight belly, we're hinging at the hips, coming all the way up, breathing in, and then exhale, take your hands to the heart. So half sun salutations, breathing in, lift, exhale, dive to the toes, breathe out. Inhale, the flat back, nice tight belly, breathe out, come down to the toes. Inhale, hinging at the hips, lead with the chest, come all the way up, exhale, take your hands to the heart. Do three more, breathing in, exhale, dive to the toes, breathe out. Inhale the flat back, exhale to the toes. Inhale, come on all the way up. And then exhale, soft shoulders, but still tight belly, hands to the heart. So again, breathing in, exhale, breathing out. So we're connecting breath with movement. Inhale, Exhale, inhale, raise your arms up, and exhale, hand to the heart. So last one, breathing in, arms up. Exhale, dive to the toes, breathe out. Tight belly, come up to the flat back. Exhale, down to the toes. Come on all the way up, reach the sky, breathing in, and then exhale, hand to the heart. Now from here, take the arms all the way up, reach, 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 and breathe out, dive to the toes, take your hands down to the mat, and step back into downward facing dog. So remember, this is a nice upside down V. The backs of the thighs are lifting up to the sky, lift those hips, draw the belly in, and see if you can have your gaze rather than to your fingertips, but a little bit more to the center of your mat. Now pedal the feet so that you can feel a nice stretch, gentle stretch into those calf muscles, into the backs of the legs, the hamstrings. Now engage the arms, press into your hands and just activate the whole body here, sending breath through the whole body. Inhale here and exhale. Come on up on the tops of the toes, bring your knees down to the mat, and let's melt into child's pose here. Breathe out. Take a deep breath in and out, softening the shoulders. One more time, inhaling and exhale. Slowly come on up. Find yourself into tabletop where the shoulders are on top of the wrists and the hips are right underneath those knees. Let's lower the belly, open up the chest for a nice cow pose. Breathe it here, in, and then exhale, breathe out, cat. Again, inhaling, cow. 
exhaling cat. Last one, breathing in, cow, and exhaling cat. Now melt back into child's pose. Sits bones are gonna go right over those heels, melting, rounding, and grounding those hips. Take a breath here. You can have your hands reaching to the front or maybe they're melting to the back. So it's your choice, your practice. Take a nice deep breath here. Inhaling and exhaling. Okay, if your hands are behind you, take the hands in front. We're gonna slowly come on up and step your left foot in front of, into the hands, okay? So nicely planted into that foot, knee on top of the ankle, back knee should be behind the hip as best as you can. So we're gonna open up the psoas, open up the chest for more breath and more warmth into the body. Let's take the arms up, drawing the belly in, breathing in, lifting and lengthening, and exhale, take your hands down. We're doing that two more times, breathing in, and exhale, breathe out, again, Inhale, lift, and exhale, take your hands down. Now lift up the chest, let's tuck the toes under, spread the fingers, and step back into that downward facing dog. Lift up those hips. Great, now come on up on the toes. We're gonna bring the knees down to the mat. Let's step the other foot in front. So again, knee on top of the ankle, back knee behind the hip. Okay, Breath, belly drawn in, lengthen up. Breathe in and breathe out. Two more times. Inhale, lift. Exhale, release. Inhale, lift. And exhale, release. Inhale, with your chest up. Tuck the back toes under. Spread those fingers. Spread them nicely onto the mat. Step back to downward facing dog. Lift up those hips and walk out the legs. Beautiful. Now, come on up from the tops of the toes. You're gonna walk your feet toward your hands into that nice forward fold. And in this forward fold, we're focused on softening the knees a bit, lifting the backs of our thighs, drawing the belly in a little bit more. And if you want a little more oomph, depending on how the body's feeling, maybe you're grabbing the backs of the legs and you're looking towards the knees. Breathing here, holding it. <sighs> not too much, not too little. We don't want to give ourselves any strain in the lower back. So if that's the case, then we just relax our hands, soften our breath, take one more breath here, inhaling and exhaling. <sighs> and let's nod our heads here, just articulating the neck. Yes. This is a positive practice for me. We're moving the body, connecting breath with movement. And let's shake our head no. Just articulating that neck again and saying to yourself, no, we'll not have any negative thoughts, negative energy. We're gonna get rid of that. Ah, okay, now from here, all that blood is flowing to our head. We're gonna be smarter after this practice Belly's tight, weight in the heels, come on up to flat back. Inhale here, exhale to the toes. And be very careful here because we've been forward full for such a long time. We need to make sure we are going to breathe in as we come on up. Inhale, hinging at the hips, belly tight. Inhale, and then exhale, <sighs> hands to the heart. Well done. Now. We're gonna to start to roll the shoulders out, making sure we're nice and comfortable to close our practice for three, two, and one. Take your arms all the way up. Inhale, and then exhale. Well done. Enjoy the rest of your day. Namaste.